What's up, everybody, and welcome to another Deoxys video, or just another Pixelmon video preview. This time, it's going to be Deoxys, and Deoxys is going to be one of the most interesting of these previews, because what Deoxys has that other Pokemon don't is four different forms. So right here, we do have the normal form, the defense form, I just cut off the defense form, the defense form, the speed form, and the attack form. So as you can see, all these models look phenomenal, and I've been saying that about all these guys, but for Deoxys... I really kind of mean it. I mean, he just looks sexy. I mean, I don't know how else to put it. This looks like something that would come out of a game made by Nintendo, not a fan-made mod by people that aren't getting paid anything. And even if we look at the shiny, it, they both just look so good. They, it just maybe it's just a good picture, but I don't know all the forms too. They just came out really, really well. I got to give major props to Lugia here, as um, they did just come out. Great, and uh, if we do scroll down, we can check out all the different forms again, and it, it, they look so polished, so well made, and I gotta really commend these guys for the amount of effort that must have gone into this, and uh, just how well they come out, though. It's definitely worth it. So if we continue on, we can find all of the different movesets, and all the different information on Deoxys himself, or is himself, herself? I don't think it has a gender, so yeah, I'm genderless. Okay, so we're just double checking on that. So Deoxys comes out of a meteor. It is a virus. It does have a whole movie based around that. I remember when that movie came out. So, you know, I saw it when it came out. It was pretty awesome back in the day. And it's pretty awesome now. I should go rewatch it to celebrate this video. You should all go watch it. That's completely, uh, you know, tapering off. But yeah, so again, Deoxys does come out of a meteor. It is a virus Pokemon. So it's very unique and very different. Obviously having all of its different forms. And I really think if the Pixelmon devs want to, they can capitalize on that. I mean, what if you have an event where a meteor crashes down to Earth and inside of it flies out to Deoxys? Or even if, you know, that might be a little hard to... Uh, code in if you just have a meteor be generated as the person walks through or when a deoxys would spawn a meteor generates where it would be and the axis flies out of that and goes flies in the air and then it could fly around and uh, you know then people have to find it but how awesome would that be and then if it despawns you could go find the meteor crash site and you're like damn it the deoxys was right here and i blew it but again i think that would be really awesome obviously i don't know how they're going to incorporate changing between all the different forms it'll be really interesting i mean in that games that you just had a different game so i don't know imagine they do it based on your ip address where you're located in the world that would actually be kind of funny but i doubt that's going to happen so obviously again it has four forms if we scroll back down we can check out the move sets or learn sets for those four forms they are all pretty similar with some minor differences such as like the normal form has a pretty big mix of um all kinds of different moves having recovers and headbutt psychic snatch psycho boost and hyper beam while uh, the attack form has pretty much exclusively attack moves there are very few moves on this list that aren't attack moves nothing too crazy though it does learn superpower at only level 49 though so that's pretty cool and um does learn zap cannon which is uh, a little out there but Again, Zap Cannon's not that great of a move. And having Psycho Boost, which again is super, super high damaging psychic move, and it's stab, but again, it has it, it lowers your special attack stats by that by two stages after you use it. So it's a little iffy on that. And then if we do go on to the defense form, which I think might actually have the best moveset, it does have counter and mirror coat, which counter is uh, if you get attacked, you'll go second and you'll do twice as much damage back to the opposing Pokemon. So that's a pretty interesting move. And um, I, I do quite like that move. So that and then obviously having recover, iron, iron defense, snatch, spikes, which is really good learning spikes so early on and um, teleport. Oh, yeah, because that's a great move. But um, yeah, it just has some pretty good, pretty basic moves um, that you should be pretty happy with. I mean, I'd be pretty happy with the defense form moves. And the speed form has extreme speed, which that's really the only thing worth commenting on. It does have agility, but I don't see any reason to use agility considering he's so fast to begin with. So yeah, otherwise, that, that's the only thing that's really great there. But nonetheless, pretty good Pokemon or pretty good movesets all around at, for a pretty good Pokemon, which we'll get into right now, as you can see. So four different Smogon pages because obviously four different types of Deoxys here. So the normal typing does have very, very interesting stats. We got 50, 150, 50, 150, 50, 150. So that's different, obviously. Having extremely low HP though, which is, I think, Deoxys' main hindering point because moves like Dragon not Dragon Claw, not Dragon Dance, Dragon Rage, and Sonic Boom that just do flat HP damage will cripple this thing because it does not have a lot of HP. What it does have, or at least the normal form have, is a lot of attack damage, a lot of special attack damage, and a high, high speed with 
you know, they're pretty crappy, but compared to the other forms, pretty good defense, pretty good special defense, and I think the HP pretty much remains the same on all forms. But yeah, nonetheless, it, it this guy is amazing because of he does a huge amount of damage, and he could outspeed just about everyone. I mean, there's very few Pokemon with speed above 150, so Deoxys obviously being able to get in, do some either attacking move or special attacking move, depending on whether the opponent has high special defense or high defense, so if you do know that, that would be really, really useful, and you could do a poop load of damage with uh, all these different moves, so obviously wanting to get a, a light screen or reflect to just get a defense up for your whole team, as that's kind of what Deoxys is going to be used for, to get in, make something happen, and either die or get out, because it doesn't last long, it can't take hits with that low of HP, and I am in full screen, yes. So, if we continue on to its first form, the attack form, which I think this is actually the best form of Deoxys, as it does have crappy defense, and it does have crappy special defense, but the other forms don't have great defense anyway. I mean, the normal form has crappy defense. This is just slightly worse. But what this guy does have is way better attack and way better. Well, not way better, but it has 30 more points in attack and 30 more points in special attack. Those are the highest attack and special attack in the game. You can't get any higher than 180. That is pretty much the limit. So if used correctly, this guy can pretty much be devastating. You can jump in, use some quick high power move, kill a Pokemon, and potentially even sweep because obviously it still has 150 speed and there's very few things that can outspeed this guy. So again, having some super, super good things and being able to kill a nice dragon Pokemon, being able to kill something like that or just do massive damage on their sweeper will be really, really good. Or if you set up correctly, being able to sweep with this guy would be phenomenal. So that's Deoxys Attack. If we go on to Deoxys Speed, this I think is the crappiest out of the forms, in my opinion at least. So, what Deoxys does have though here is the low HP, again they all have crappy HP. He does have some better attack, defense, special attack, special defense. But that all kind of comes short to the speed, which this is the fastest Pokemon in the game, and obviously will be the fastest Pokemon in Pixelmon, nonetheless. But what it doesn't really have is anything else. I mean, as I said before, you could be really fast, but it's not outspeeding anything that, like, there's very few things faster than the other forms. And this thing only gets really more speed. I mean, it's attack and defense. It might be able to survive two hits instead of one, but it doesn't do nearly as much damage, which really hinders it. And again, there's very few Pokemon in that 150 to 180 window like not he's not going to be faster than that many pokemon just because he gained an extra 30 speed that's why i think this guy really falls short what he does excel at though is getting up being the first pokemon out to throw out some spikes or some stealth rock and uh, getting up like a good defense thing or a good offense a defensive offensive move uh like some status effect move Maybe like that, because that will make him really viable. I mean, if you could jump in and just get down a Spikes or a Stealth Rock, maybe even a Toxic, and then you switch out, or like a something similar to that, because it's almost guaranteed that Deoxys will go sh first. I mean... There's very few situations where he'll go second, so if you use him smart, the Oxy Speed can be viable, but I don't know. He's not that great. He's, well, he's still a great Pokemon, but compared to the other Deoxys, Deoxys's, he's not that great. So if we do get onto Deoxys defense, he is very interesting. I mean, if used correctly, this guy can be phenomenal. But for a defensive Pokemon, he has crappy HP. But he does have really high defense and really high special defense. So if you could get around that whole HP de deficit, you can use this guy to your advantage and to some pretty high advantages. I mean, he does have extremely high defense and special defense, unparalleled in Pixelmon right now. Because right now in Pixelmon, if you want a tanky wall Pokemon, your option really just comes to Chansey, or Blissey, rather. But And Blissey has extremely high HP and lower defense and special defense. So that makes it an interesting trade-off once Deoxys gets added. Because this is going to be the complete polar opposite, essentially. It's going to have really high defense and special defense, but really low HP. So, I mean, I guess it's really going to be what you want to have on your team. I mean, if used correctly, you can have a Recover and Toxic, just hurting, hurtling down Pokemon and uh, weighing people down. But at the same time, if anything like, you know, a Sonic Boom or a Dragon Rage comes in, you're going to be pretty crippled. So, that is my little uh, video preview of Deoxys. It's going to be an awesome Pokemon when it gets added. I'm really excited for it. Definitely probably one of the most exciting Pokemon just because it's models and the way it's incorporated in all different forms, and it's a legendary, so that's always awesome. So yeah, we'll see what happens with that.